Hello, my name is Roger, and this is the Krakolandia, the crack land. Behind me is uh, the people who live under the, the bridge. Potato, uh, carrot, uh, pasta, tomato, and so many different vegetables. And this is very strong. Oh, and of course, a bit of ground beef. We put a ground beef around here. So let's do it this together. Thanks a lot. See ya. Let's go. Now, what time is now? 10? 10 26 p.m. And now we go. We start at 9 o'clock a.m. And now we go in there. We have 159 meals 
and 50 liters of uh, juice, Guarana juice. So let's do it. Good luck for us. We have around 150, 150 people around here. This is like a little house that has one in here, another one there, a one and one behind you. So they, they live all together. Up here is the bridge. The bridge, the bridge is up here. And this is the, the light cables, see around here. And this is how they live. We have house, little house everywhere around here. Check it out inside the house. This is the house. We are behind, we are under the bridge. Very nice house. If we come here in the night shift, the night time, you, you see these people burning fire uh, because they put, uh, they have uh, telephone cables and they put fire here because they have to burn to sell the metal who has inside of the telephone cables. So not, not now in the day shift, but if you come at night, you see these people here burning this cable to get the, the metal to, to sell. We wish to get opportunity to come here every day, but this is not possible yet. Sometimes we come, we come one time a week or maybe one time two weeks. Always when I come, I come with my sons, Arthur, Bernard, John. But Roger, why you bring you, your kids to a place like this? They have to see how hard life is for some people. And, uh, but tell me Roger, why you do this? We just try to, to give some love to them. You know, because these people who live here, their family doesn't care about them. The people who pass across, across the street, they also doesn't care about them. The people who pass by car, they are like ghosts to them. So what we do, we just come to, to live a little bit love and say, we care about you. Of course, it's just a food and a glass of water, but we do what we can do. One day, I wish, we can come here every day and bring food to them every single day. And also, maybe you ask, you say, Roger, but you just give food and these people, they don't wanna out of the drugs. We give opportunity also. I have a friend that he has a, a, a recuperation center that if the people want, we can bring them to there. But it's very, very hard. And we still try give food some days and maybe we can take one, two or three people out of this. Let's be part of this with us. Let's do this together. Yeah.